both. I know with like primer I use my hands at the same time, but other than that, like dang, I'm only using my left hand. So I'm up for the challenge. I'm gonna do it. Um, I'm not sure who came up with this. I've seen a few of them and it looks very complicated. So let's get started. We're gonna first start off with primer. I'm taking the Smashbox photo finish. You guys know with primer, I mean, I think we all use both of our hands. So it's not something that I'm like super terrified about. We're concentrating the left hand on the left side and the right hand on the right side. So it's kind of like, can I not do this? Okay, so this is not hard at all. It is kind of weird now that I'm trying to like blend it down to the bottom of the neck because like, I kind of want to go like boom, boom, and I have to go like. I'm gonna be taking the Make a Forever Stick Foundation. I'm gonna take the color Y215 and the color Y335. I'm gonna mix these. This already feels weird. I haven't even gotten started yet. I do like to mix these two just because one's very light and the other one's a little bit more tan. So it's gonna work out perfectly fine. Oh my god. <laughs> Wait, I already feel so freaking weird. Like, I can't multitask like this, you know? All right, Lord. Okay. Oh my god, this is like so difficult. Okay, let me switch now. Just so they could be like nice and blended. Um, how do I say it? It's it's hurting my brain. <laughs> I'm just kidding. The great thing is that I honestly do mix these on the daily because I don't know what the hell I would do if it was like I, I don't I wouldn't have two of the same foundation. I have my two 3D HD blender sponges. Yeah, I got somewhere to go after this, so I'm really hoping I could do this right. Cause I'm not about to do my makeup all over again. I mean, it doesn't look bad. I mean, I'm just terrified to think about like the eyes, maybe. <sighs> My eyebrows, that's what I should be worried about. Okay, so this is not bad at all. Oh, ugh, I was using one hand already, you saw that? Now time to highlight the face. Now luckily, I have two of the same concealers. These are the LA Girl Pro concealers in the color Classic Ivory. I haven't used these in a while though, so I'm gonna shake them up a little bit because I know these can get a little bit liquidy. So I'm gonna take both concealers and just go right in there. Why do I feel like this is not even my color? Okay, this is like, Ah, it's a lot harder than it looks, you guys. Like, no joke. Mm-mm. Nope, I'm screwing up. This is a lot of product. <laughs> oh my god. I can't do my freaking right hand. All right, so now I'm gonna take these sponges, go in there and dab this out. I feel like I'm way more focused on my left side because that's just a hand that I usually use. Am I gonna succeed? Am I not? Let a girl know. <laughs> Okay, what the hell? I can't do this. All right, the face looks great. I'm gonna take my Airspun Loose Powder to bake the face, and I'm gonna go in, grab some powder, and start baking. Oh, okay. That's not that hard. Let's do all the face, might as well. Okay, so the face is now all nice and baked. I think, um, I think we got this. Now to highlight the face, I'm gonna be taking the Hula Bronzer and the Hula Light. Okay, I feel like this is gonna get hard. I feel like, you see, I stopped using one hand, okay. Because I need to see exactly what I'm doing, you know? Okay, this head looks good. This head looks like it's barely been touched. <laughs> Come on, dig in. Like, I'm really trying to do a good job, you guys. I really got errands to run today. Move on to the forehead. Oh, hell no. I feel like the fear is really, like, reading me right now. I feel like my cheekbones are not chiseled enough. <laughs> but, girl, I mean, I gotta say, though, my contour is coming out better than it does when I freaking use just my left hand. Now time for blush. I'm gonna be mixing California and dandelion. Yeah. The good thing is not like, ah! Oh, you see how I like will switch off only with one hand? This is not what I'm supposed to be doing. So let's move on to highlighter. If I screw it up with highlighter, that's it. I'm gonna take the over highlighter in the color Real Deal with Drive. Such a beautiful color. Oh. That looks good. That doesn't look bad. I'm wondering how the hell I'm gonna do my nose. Okay, that's all we're doing. I'm just gonna take it a little bit. Oh, hold on. I need to like chill out because this looks hella bright. So now moving on to eyeshadow. I feel like this is gonna be the trickiest part. I'm gonna first start off with my transition color. I'm gonna take the color Creme Brulee by Makeup Geek. Okay, we're gonna jump right in. Let me just dust off some of the extra powder. Okay. I feel like one brush is more dense than the other, so I'm a little bit afraid it's gonna look a little bit different. So I'm gonna just switch off brushes really quickly. I'm not sure if that's cheating. I don't think so, because I'm still using both hands. All right, that's not that hard, actually. To deepen up the crease, I'm gonna take Bitten by Makeup Geek, and I'm gonna take these crease brushes. Oh, this is like really not as hard as I thought, though. The brushes are so different. I'm gonna have to switch. I feel like just one side is coming out 
more pigmented. This is really smart. I, I think I'm doing this faster. I think if I get this right, I'm gonna start doing this more often because if I'm in a freaking rush, like, girl, you better believe I'm gonna pop these hands out. So now I'm gonna take this color. I believe this was an 04 eyeshadow and I don't have the freaking name in the back of it. It's really pretty, it's like a bronzy color. I've been really using this a lot lately, like on the eyelid. I love the way that it looks. It gives the eyes kind of like a nice smoky look. I'm gonna use actually two different, completely different brushes. I don't even know how I'm gonna do it, but I'm gonna do it. I cannot find one exactly like this. But I am gonna be switching off back and forth. That way we get everything nice and even so we're gonna pop this on oh yeah that's way different how can I even see what I'm doing when I have like both eyes like this we legitimately cannot see what I'm doing there you go it's looking more better ah, I feel like I'm messing up my freaking crease I blame the brushes I mean I'm gonna take these crease brushes and see like what I can do maybe I can actually blend it out better I think we're getting somewhere I feel like the eyeshadow just overall looks like crap yeah, that's looking way better than how it was coming out. Ooh, yes, I'm liking this. I'm gonna go back in with the fluffy brushes because y'all know this looks a little crazy right now. I'm gonna line my waterline using two black eyeliners. <laughs> Hold on, this is like, actually, I can't do this. This actually looks really dangerous. We're getting somewhere. This one's more pigmented though. I think it's working. So I'm gonna coat my lashes. I'm gonna take the Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. I have two of the exact same. All right, let's go in there. Low key, like I think I'm getting this done really fast. Oh, I can't get in the inner corner. I don't wanna do so much with the mascara because I know I could poke my eyes. I feel like I'm trying to like wiggle my head instead of the mascara. Now time for false lashes. I'm gonna be taking the Lily Lashes and the Style Caramel. Yo, these are freaking dramatic. I love them. So I'm gonna pop them on with, of course, my both hands and um, hopefully I could do a great job. I think this is gonna be the hardest. Oh God, let's do this. Okay, I think we got that. Okay. Now let's get the outer corners. Oh my god, this is so freaking hard. I, I I don't know what I'm doing. Okay, I can't do this. I cannot do this. Oh shit, oh shit. For now, we're just gonna move on to the eyebrows. So I'm gonna first take these two spoolies and comb out the brows. Now, because this one's out, I can't use this one. So I'm gonna take this one. This is the Anastasia Brow Definer in the color Ebony. And I'm gonna take this Makeup Forever in the number 50. I'm gonna start by outlining it. All right, I'm gonna start at the bottom. No, I'm already messing it up. I thought I had it, so I started my eyebrows. Oh, oh my god, I cannot even believe I had the confidence. Okay, let's um start flicking the hairs upwards. I gotta say though, I mean, I'm using two completely different brow pencils. It's because if I'm focusing on one, the other one's coming out like shit. I, I just cannot. I feel like there's no hope for these brows. I don't even know what to say. I feel like I'm just gonna screw it all up. I can't do this. Like, I legitimately think the more I touch, the more I'm gonna screw up. I'm literally just gonna stop right there. I'm gonna ruin them. I'm just gonna move on to the lips because your girl don't got time to fix her brows. Like, honestly, I just can't do it. Like, I'm ruining them more as I go. So, for lipstick, I'm gonna mix these two. I'm gonna take this one by Makeup Geek in the color Docido and this Makeup Forever one in the number 103. So, we'll see how this turns out. Okay. Ah! Okay, mm, they're kind of similar. All right, I'm gonna like switch now, just so we can mix these. Okay, I just really wanna like not ruin the cupid bow. <gasps> that does not look bad. Okay, let's mix it in again. I like how my lips came out. Oh my god. All right, you guys. So this is my finished look. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys think. Let me tell y'all what I think. I think my brows look tore up. There is no saving them. The eyeshadow, I mean, I'm very shocked. I'm very surprised that it came out like this. I love the eyeshadow. The eyelashes, on the other hand, I think this eyelash barely even stuck on. The inner corner is loose. The center is loose. The outer corner is loose. And then this eyelash looks perfectly fine. But when you look down, this whole little spot right there is not glued on as far as for my lips as well I'm kind of shocked if I was really in a rush I would really consider using my both hands but you guys honestly I am shocked I kind of like how this looks thank you guys so much for watching I love you guys so much don't forget to turn on the notifications that way you guys are updated when I upload new videos
videos. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!